Hey guys, welcome to another video for SimonsVideo.com and my name is Simon Tay and today I'm going to do a DIY hanging sliding lights holder. Okay, there's two problems that I faced in my previous tank. The aquarium lights has been blocking my way from um, you know plant things and doing all kinds of things and the aquarium lights does come with this uh, little clamp at the side which does not fit my aquarium tank. So I've been thinking hard and trying to solve this problem and finally I found the answer <laughs> okay what you're looking at is my lights at the inverse portion where I've drilled using a portable drill to drill through the center of the lights uh, make sure you do not drill into the bulbs otherwise it'll be very very expensive mistakes drill into the center make sure uh, it is uh, you know uh, true and true and the correct size bits and I'm using this little uh, circle thing this usually is to drill into the wall but I, I actually use this to uh, you know put into the, the lights with the correct nut and washer it should be fastened just nice into the uh, T5 lights that I have and I actually did some trial and error initially I've created a two um, PVC pipes to hang on the lights uh, but later realized it's not very stable because the lights are pretty um, heavy so I added two more pipes to stabilize it then realized um, it's not really actually doing much other than hanging the light so uh, eventually I come up with this uh, curtain uh, rod thingy so I asked the, the hardware shop to cut uh, to a certain size and then I drill hole inside the, the center of this this uh, curtain rod and come up with this okay let's talk about the pros and cons of this design this design is definitely solve a lot of problems first thing it does hang my light stable enough to a certain height that I want more desired height it is very stable and it can be pushed backwards uh, to the you know back of the tank so that I can actually access to the plantings and the, the catching of fish or things like that very readily and easily and without any obstructions and when I'm done I can actually push it back and into the center of the aquarium tank without any obstructions uh, the second is cheap to make uh, everything is uh, relatively cheap so the total cost is less than like $50 Singapore dollars so it's, it's relatively cheap uh, the only downside it is uh, uh, slightly unsightly on the top end so some of the pipes are there uh, pretty unsightly sometimes but if you can overlook the unsightliness of the pipes it's definitely a very uh, usable DIY hanging lights with sliders of the curtain rod which is awesome <laughs> Uh, and basically that's it for this video and of course do comment in the comment section below what do you think about this project and what do you think I can do to improve on this project or you have something even better more elegant uh, do let me know of course the, uh, considering the cost factor and of course the user friendliness and of course the pro and cons of this uh, this project <laughs> and of course do comment share like and subscribe <laughs> thank you very much for watching Simon's video. Have a nice day. See ya. Bye-bye.